So we're going to be in a little bit of a holding pattern right here. So the next one is uh, JJ Rockets and Atta. Now we're just kind of holding. Just holding our places until they find some commentators. For yeah, us. because while it has been fun commentating this, I definitely need a break because I think I'm in amateur bracket. I too am in amateur bracket. Yeah. And they called neither of us. But uh, and it looks like they've found a couple people to replace us. But once again, guys, thanks for tuning in to ETC Poplar Creek Bowl Weekly. Mm -hmm. It's been really fun. It's been interesting with these uh, with the three stock uh, setup. We got button check going. On. Yeah, button check on the custom stage. Now this is uh, this is an interesting concept for a stage. Yeah, just two diamond shaped platforms. That's, I mean, I understand it, but very interesting. This is this is a little max worse nightmare. Holy. Cow. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no ledges. No, no platform to save you from up air screen. No you only have like those little tiny lips to go to, to try and cling on to. Yeah, that's that's a heart attack. No way. wall jumps to help you with your recovery at all. The other person can just camp the other platform. You're forced to approach with either an aerial or side B. That was weird. <laughs> oh no, there he goes. Holy. All over the place, these two. I don't even know how to commentate this button check. This is just shenanigans. <laughs> All right, so we got one. We got Uno. We found people. All right, so Thank we're going to be hopping much. off. All right. Thanks for uh, tuning in. I'll see you guys later. Hey guys. Alright, hi, this is Unibronies. Um, I'm with Red. Red, right. Yep. Okay, so it's JJ Rockets versus Atata. Atata. Okay. How's how's the sound how's the sound sound good? Alright, sweet. Alright, so jumping right into the match, we got a uh, winner semis, JJ Rockets versus Tata. Ness Diddy Kong, what do you feel? What do you feel? I kind of feel like the banana was gonna be a lot in his favor just because Ness kind of struggles with the projectile mm -hmm. game and like Diddy, like he would combo off of a lot of it. And like Diddy, what's the thing is like with Ness, he kind of doesn't have like a get off, a good get off me move because Diddy could just go up in his face and do whatever. Like right now, you best someone. Right. Yeah, I mean besides from there and even that, it's just like I don't know. But uh, I mean, as we can tell, like exactly what you're saying, he's just getting so much damage off of bananas. Right, and then it's I can bananas, see him, I can see him ending it off stage to do the best because of Diddy's really good kick, uh, kick game. Mm -hmm. yeah. Definitely. I was surprised. Uh, looking for something there off the down tilt, but didn't get quite the KO. But uh, I had to just throw for a bit. Oh, damage. he missed on there. Okay, that's fine. Mm -hmm. it's definitely, yeah. So you can see that JJ oh. oh, he dragged a lot of damage. He ends up really fast. Okay. Garbage style. Not bad. <laughs> that's total imagination. <laughs> All right. So um, back to neutral. It's Complete the, stock down now. See, rough, like but, uh, how what I'm seeing right now is Teta is like approaching. Not on safety, but he kind of doesn't have any other option mm -hmm. to like approach. He's approaching with Nair and like Fair, which is good, but if JJ were to power shield it, he could just punish it. Right. Like I said, Diddy is just going up in his face, grabbing, doing a bunch of combos, throwing out Banana. He's pressuring him with Banana, like he's positioning it with Nair. Okay, he got the Banana. This, yep. this is definitely really good. Has to capitalize, hopefully, but uh. He's still looking bad for Teta. And yeah. they grabbed the Banana right out of his hand right there. Okay. I thought the, did you see the peanut where it was about to hit the PK Thunder? I oh. thought it was going to cancel out. Oh, that would have been really good. That would have been pretty clutch. But, uh, I mean, JJ doesn't even need clutch moments right now. He's uh, looking super clean with three stocks, 66. 
Wait. Six, six, six. Oh. Ooh, he pressured his shield with a bunch of top toads, and then he rolled. I think he jumped. Yeah, he jumped. Definitely. Yeah. Caught him out of the jump, and uh, that's a stock. Three stocks, though, so there's still a chance here for his head up. Let's see if he can grab, maybe. Maybe even learn some more info for next I think he got three stocks. I mean, it might can be a comeback. We don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this man's four three stock comeback. <laughs> yeah. Oh, never again, though. <laughs> yeah. All right. If he gets a perfect back throw, I think it would just be stock, for sure. But like I said, problem with the Ness to Diddy matchup is wrecking damage. Mm -hmm. Diddy can like like I said go up in the space and do whatever, and then off stage. And, uh, and honestly, like how he can just grab right now. Oh, there oh. We go. there's an air. Mm -hmm. He doesn't need the back Plus, throw. Okay, Plus the move right there out of the air, and that's a stock. Good stuff. Right. Pressuring his shield, but he learned last time not to jump out. So he's calmly, okay, this is good. He's getting good hitboxes in. Let's good combo. Definitely. That's good damage right there. Ooh. Oh, he was going to go for the PK Thunder 2 on ledge. That would have been really good. And you know, even if, even if he doesn't clutch this out, I mean... He's he, adapting, adapting really fast. Yeah, he's adapted. And that's, you know what, that's a scarier game too with the counter pick and everything. Yeah, exactly. I'm really surprised they picked Lila game one. You don't see that often. No, definitely not. Yeah. Definitely not. <laughs> It's a very weird stage. It's a very counter pick. Oh my oh. god, read the spot by the four smash. It's 1 1. And this is Smash Force with Rage and this is not. Three out stock. Of oh. oh, okay. <laughs> Missed the first, second hit. Okay, good. So, what Ted is trying to do is just pressure oh, him geez. with a lot of hitboxes. Yeah, there we go. Okay, this is awesome. He's There's reading his approach options. He's reading his approach options and punch it, like going away from his grab. Literally, that's what JJ would do all the time either throw a banana or grab. Mm -hmm. And you know what? He's just adapting perf perfectly right now. Definitely. I, I definitely can see him coming back in game two way stronger than this. Mm -hmm. And even now, I mean, let's not count him out. I mean, oh. <laughs> well, this is kind of <laughs> This is kind of nutty, this for sure. Oh, oh wow. No. The mix ups on ledge. Okay, JJ Rocket's taking game one. Ateta's been adapting, so we'll see in game two what's gonna happen. I can kind of feel that Ateta would not lose two, his, two, his first two stocks very fast, like first game. Definitely. Um, like I said, if he were just to avoid grab more often from JJ, and then if he were to punish with his grab and follow ups with his bo hitboxes, then mm -hmm. I'm sure that he will. Definitely. Maybe, maybe win the match. Maybe come on top and hopefully go to game three. Yeah. Some good Smash 4 here. We need casual upsets here in Chicago. Now, Ness Diddy Kong, where do you think Ness wants to take Diddy Kong right now? I can definitely see not taking him in a platform stage. Okay. Um, just because of how Ness can, no, I'm sorry, how can Diddy, Diddy not juggle? Oh, wait. Diddy, D oh, sorry. Okay, JJ Rockets is banning. Yeah, right, yeah so, so he picked him. I don't know, though. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I, I, know I have seen it had to take a lot of people to uh, Battlefield. I'm sure he's, I, I don't know if it's a comfort thing or a Ness thing, but... Uh, he probably, yeah, he probably just prefers the stage. I'm not really sure on, like, Ness to Diddy, because I barely see his match about him. Yeah. You know, I, it, it's Ness that loses in many high tiers, and I'm assuming Diddy Kong is one of the losing matchups. Yeah, right? you're yeah, definitely, definitely right for sure. I know that for a fact, because, like I said, Banana, and a lot of pressure you can apply with. But, like I said, he's missing a lot of grabs now. Ooh. Of, yeah, exactly. So if he gets a grab, he's just going to whip out a bunch of hitboxes, and this is how he wins the new game. Definitely. Um, but if he keeps it up that way, and then hopefully JJ not mixing up his combo game, then he can win. Yep. Oh, wow. Just cancels out Ted OP with the banana. <laughs> that was awesome. That was yeah. really good. These pair of players are totally so aware right now of the projectiles going around the stage. Yeah. Ooh. Throwing out his projectile. Here we go. Oh, no. Back, back on the stage. Back on the stage. All right. Um, definitely JJ still looking clean, but let's see how it's. Oh, oh, the Trump back air. But then he's still living. He's still living. No, it's Battlefield. Mm. I think this is part of the counter pick. This yeah. is because of the. You can't die that early. Okay, but obviously the up smash would kill you. Garbage. Right. <laughs> <laughs> the garbage combo. <laughs> no, you read yeah. the ledge option. And definitely reason not to go Dreamland over this because you know, Diddy Kong. I'm assuming he could just kill so fast with the uh, hoo ha combo. Low ceiling. Mm -hmm. Yes, exactly. Yep. All right. Okay, yeah, so doing JJ a lot of down, down yeah. smash. I like, I like that. He's mixing up his game now. Uh, you can, if you notice, he went for less grabs. It was more of just like Diddy stuff, just hitting him, literally, and then uh, applying pressure. And then once, like, I feel like once Atata adapts to that, he's he's gonna mix it up with grabs again. It's just gonna go back and forth. But like, I, but like, what I'm trying to say is that. Oh, oh good, the dirty spike. Oh okay. okay. No, Atata's coming. The counter, the counter garbage. Up air? No, he got the banana. Okay, mm. this is good. This is good. That was not a bad choice. He was oh, shield yeah. pressure, grabbed the banana, and he grabbed the banana. But, uh, Definitely really good. It's out of his hands now. <laughs> That's fine. Yep. Let's see what he can do. Oh, oh no. Oh, wait, no, he's fine. Okay. Because yep. you know what? JJ is not going to challenge that. Definitely not going to challenge that. He read the ledge option again. Mm -hmm. Rolling in against a Diddy is definitely... Actually, ledge options against Diddy is really hard to know. I can imagine. Yeah. It seems like he covers, covers so many things. He can with his speed, you know? There we oh. go. There we go. See, he's going for less grabs, which is more like There's claps. Shipping, yep. <laughs> well, we don't know. Maybe a Teddy will come back like last time. <laughs> so Definitely. we don't know. This is three socks. We'll and see what happens. Battlefield, so he should live even longer. Hopefully. Hopefully. 
Ooh. I think it's red. Up air. Oh, back air. Forward air. Forward air. No. Just he saved his jump. Oh, the dirt. Oh, oh janky dee jank jank. Oh my god, let's go. Three stock boys. Down to jank. Yeah, right? <laughs> Three stock. <laughs> okay. Forward air. Oh, back air. I like that stuff. Definitely. I was, I was assuming one of those were going to hit him, but nothing got him. <laughs> he just read the eye wrong. Mm -hmm. but like you know I said, what, Ted is coming back, bro. Look at this. Dude, this is awesome. Oof. He oh. read the legend. Oh my god. I think I thought he was going to go for something way cooler than that. And the down he probably wasn't ready for it, though. Yeah. Oh. Okay. This is fine. This is fine. It's fine. Oh, no. Totally. Tata can come back to this end. Oh, Hopefully. Okay. So wow. this is where he's gonna. He might lose here if JJ Rockets needs a ledge option like last time. Ooh. Okay. That's really good. JJ. Oh, the that's comeback. Three Stage stock spike. boys. Okay. And oh, no, he's excited. Good. He's and good. I'm still excited. I'm still excited. This is good. This is good. I'm not going to challenge that Tata again. Back. No. Oh. oh. Oh my Battlefield. God. This is definitely the counter pick. Yeah, definitely the counter pick. I, I, you see the you see the lightning, but you don't see the stock. And I don't know. You can't awesome. All right. Okay. He has to do something. He has to do something really clutch, clutch right now. Because Diddy Kong, if he gets a down tilt, it could just be anything in imagination. Ooh, oh, ooh, but he missed the read. read. He missed the read. That's fine. Oh, got the banana. Got the no, banana there. he slipped on the banana. Yeah, he slipped. That's right. Yeah. Mm. Uh -oh, oh, this is a scary situation. No. He's good. No. Oh, there is one more it's time. That'll loot that time. I don't know if you noticed, but Atero literally lost 90% of the time because of the ledge options that he chose. Dang. So, yeah. No, if yeah, he, definitely. And yeah. I mean, like... If he were to stay like more grounded and less off stage, mm -hmm. I definitely think he would win the neutral. At least not win, but more of just doing better than yeah. what he was doing before. Definitely. He died from uh, down tilt to imagination on ledge. He died to up smash... I th those trumps yeah. to bears were just yeah getting definitely him. ledge was literally where he lost so I feel mm -hmm. like next time what you should work on is just trying to be mixing up his ledge options and not being afraid to s come back on stage with different ways because he kept rolling in or he would just do standard get up and then JJ would just read that option mm -hmm. definitely easier said than done though I can't help but feel uh attended good I though feel the fear with him yeah attended good though overall oh no definitely that was really good on his part um so who's next I think D Tran hopefully Sturm. You don't know. Oh, oh. that's fine. 